heard these words before, but I'll teach you what they really mean! Go beyond! Plus! Hello beautiful people! My name is Rare Ultra, and welcome back to Monster Hunter Rise. Now, as I said before, I took a little bit of time, did a little bit to get us to a point where we can start fighting large monsters. Now, we do have our first urgent quest, which is to take out a great Izuchi. So we're going to go do that. This is our very first large monster of Rise. The last episode was probably a bit boring. I apologize for that. Uh, the start off of a game is a little rough sometimes. Especially with a game like this, so, you know, did what I could. Alright, so we'll pay with money, uh, bunny dongo. What is order the usual? Okay, so I, I can choose. I really should read this. Let's do that. That seems like a good selection. Okay, I like this. This is cool. <laughs> That's adorable. <laughs> I all three at once. It's adorable. I like this. I like this. This is cool. Very cool. Alright. So we've eaten. Let's head to the quest game. First comes the Vanguard, unstoppable tank. Then comes the second, attacking the flank. Finally, the general, the highest in rank. The tree of blades, swift as a gale. That's cool. They cut to the bone and kill without fail. I'm not singing any of this. That's not happening at any point, just so you guys know. All right. I could do to get a little bit more health, but I'm not worried about it. Let's go let's go get this great Izuchi. I meant stamina, not health, but I am gonna grab this wire bug though. Definitely like having a third wire bug. Our first Large monster hunt of Rise. Hopefully this one that I'm heading to is actually the monster I'm looking for, the Great Izuchi. And it is! Awesome sauce, awesome sauce. Now, anybody who saw my World series will realize that I'm a lot more aggressive when I'm... Ah. I'm a lot more aggressive when I'm playing my uh, dual blades.
Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Are you writable? Oh, for crap's sakes. I'm trying to make him rideable. Why are you not rideable yet? Close the distance. Oh, I missed the stab. Am I missing a part of how to make him rideable and I just forgot it? I think I might be. I think I'm just forgetting a part. Oh, you hit the wrong way. I still haven't gotten enough to get him. I'm obviously missing something here. You missed. I mean, if you want to sit still, that's fine. I'll just beat the crap out of you, I guess. You and your little boys. Because I shouldn't say that. I should say your homeboys. What happens if I do it twice? Okay, so it breaks one if I do it twice. All right, I need to heal real quick. Healing is so much faster in this one than world. While it's down, let's go ahead and demon mode.
All right, the monster's ready to die. We're, we're chasing it down. Ow. That hurt. You jerk. Not what I meant to do. Yes. Like I said, my playstyle with the blades far more aggressive than my playstyle with the with the lance. I go crazy <laughs> with the dual blades. Like, absolutely go crazy. I go off. Can't say I've seen anyone put more enthusiasm into hunting a great Izuchi. <laughs> I knew you had real talent, but you're putting all those other hunters to shame. You could even be... Hmm. <laughs> Look at me rambling on like the old fool I am. Pretend you heard nothing, okay? Anywho... Now that you handled that urgent request, Hinoa has two star quests ready to roll. Why don't you go check them out? Alright, so Hinoa wants to say something. A lot of people want to talk to me. Welcome back. That great Izuchi has been hunted and the ingredients have been delivered safely. Yomoki is back to her usual routine, and I'm no longer in panic mode. Crisis averted. And now, as a reward for the defender of the Dongo, you can take on two star quests. You're on your way to the top. But you're not out of the woods yet. More dangerous threats await, so make sure to prepare well. So now I have village quests. It looks like we have the Azuros, or the Argeros, uh, a Great Baggy, and a Lagombi. I need to take out three. So, the last thing we always do in Monster Hunter, now that we've taken out a new enemy we take a look at exactly what the armor looks like there it is uh that's not what i wanted to do Ooh, i would like that more if it didn't take away my hair i like my hair what's the difference between these two they look the same i don't know that's weird they are the same the heck? Okay, whatever. Um, I definitely don't want that. But the Izuchi, I, I like it. Oh, wait, I can toggle off the helmet, though. So it shouldn't be a problem. I do kind of like the Izuchi armor. I might see if we can... I might spend some time hunting the great Izuchi. Last thing we need to take a look at... Weapons can be created at a smithy. Yeah, I know all that. I know how this works. All right, so I can upgrade my swords, my dual blades, as they are right now. Upgrade. So I've upgraded my, my dual blades now.
Like, are these... Like, the match slicers are better, and so are the bone hatchets. But I like the Kimura weapon. I don't know if it's... Maybe it'll get better? I don't know. We'll find out. Anyway, that's going to do it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. Next time, we're going to hunt some more great monsters, some more big monsters. But hopefully by then, I'll be in the Azuchi armor, because I want to get the Azuchi armor on. Uh, so... We'll hunt some more of the large monsters and mo make progress on the storyline in the next episode. I don't know which one we're going to go for necessarily, but we'll go for one soon. Thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out, and I'll see you next time. Later.